I see you gather before me. Hungry, terrified, clutching your babes to your breast. Emperor Emir has marched his legions into our lands, laid siege to every fortress from here to the Blue Mountains. Rabid and ravenous, he bites and bites away. Men of the North! You stand at the precipice. Your kings have failed you, so now you turn to the gods. And yet you do not plead. You do not kneel to dust your heads with ash. Instead, you wail, why have the gods forsaken us? We must look into the trials we failed long ago. In a time past, our world intertwined with another through an upheaval scholars call the conjunction of the spheres. The gods allowed unholy forces to slip into our domain. The offspring of that cataclysm was the nefarious force called magic. Yet we did not banish it, instead studying the vile arcane for our own power and wealth. And the monsters at our door, the unholy relics of this conjunction, the trolls, the corpse-eaters, the werewolves, did we raise our swords against them? Or have we laid this burden on others? On so-called witches. Stray children taught the ways of foul sorcery. Their bodies mutated through blasphemous ritual. Sent to fight monsters, though they could not distinguish good from evil. The flicker of humanity long extinguished within them. <laughs> yes, their numbers have dwindled through the years. But a few still roam our lands, offering their bloody work for coin. To this day, they shame us with their very existence. The North bleeds! Flogged by war! The battles are the gods' whip, chastisement for our sins. And let us not forget the terrors, the scourges from beyond our world. The wild hunt rides the sky with every full moon. The Dark Raiders abduct our children into lands unknown. Some say they herald a second conjunction. Can we chart a course back into the light? Will we find the strength to banish the mages from our kingdoms? Unite around the warmth of the eternal fire. Nigh is the time of the sword and axe. None will fight this war in our stead. Nigh! It's the time of madness and disdain.
You know I don't find that amusing. It wasn't meant to amuse, but to prod you to hurry. It's midday already. You promised Siri you'd train with her. Go before Vesemir bores her to death with those etchings. So, later then. Hmm. See you later. Hello everybody, Badge here, uh, today I am going to be playing, uh, The Witcher 3, The Wild Hunt, um, I just kind of showed the opening cutscenes there without talking, um, so here's the thing, I don't know if I'm going to end up including my menuing between the, because the first cutscene you saw was like when you first started the game, the stuff before you even get to the menu, and then, uh, the second cutscene was like when you hit start new game. I don't know if I'm going to show you, you the menuing. I might just cut that out just to connect the cutscenes um, through editing. Um, but um, I am playing New Game Plus. Um, so, and I've, I've never played New Game Plus. It's a DLC that came out recently. There's, if you don't know about this game, there's uh, 16 DLCs. I think New Game Plus was the 16th DLC, actually. Uh, other DLCs include some alternate appearances, which I do have enabled. Um, and, uh, some side quests and stuff. No, uh, major DLC has released, um, that, like, paid DLCs. There's, there's two planned. It's like a $25 season pass. I, I don't have it right now. I probably will eventually get it. I might do a playthrough of the DLC with the first, like, expansion when it comes, like, probably not when it comes out, because it comes out, like, very close to Halo 5 Guardians, and I might not have the time to play both. And also, I don't have the money to really buy it, and I've already bought Halo 5. But anyways, let's get into this. Uh, so, uh, a new, welcome to New Game Plus. A portion of clearance has been added to your inventory. You can use it to help your spend the ability to it so, so you can redistribute them. Wait, do I not have them at all? Wait, I can't get into my inventory. Okay, um, so I guess I'll have to do that later after I complete the intro sequence. Uh, so this is just like the prologue. By the way, uh, just like a couple different playthroughs I started, uh, I don't know if I'll end up Mountain finishing this, I'm talking about like not playthroughs of The Witcher, but I mean playthroughs of games on my channel. Uh, I, uh, don't worry about that. Um, I, um, huh. I did not actually mean to do that. I could have said that, uh, oh, yeah, I totally meant to do that. Uh, <laughs> it's, been a, it's been a while since I played this game, but, uh, okay. You're not supposed to go that way, believe it or not. Um, wait, actually, that's the only door. You are supposed to go that way, I think. But, um, I'll do my best to try to censor part of that because I don't even know if I have to. It doesn't show it full boobage, but it does show full ass. I don't know. Shit. Mountain pass is beautiful as ever. Yeah. I am running a few mods, by the way. Uh, there'll just be little things you'll notice throughout my playthrough. Oh, and uh, the reason this video is only at 30 FPS is because my game can only my, my computer can only handle this game at 30 FPS, so I locked the game at 30 FPS. 
Sorry about that. Um, okay. Uh, sorry I don't have a, you know, $3,000 computer to play this game. It's 1080p and 60 FPS. I'm playing it 1080p, 30 FPS. Fuck you guys. Uh, it's actually going down to 25 at some point. I don't know if that's because I'm recording or not. Anyways, uh, yeah, I have, like, a graphics mod installed. Believe me, guys, I actually don't get performance hits because of this graphics mod. It plays actually the same. I can't play 60 FPS, no matter what, even if I'm playing vanilla. Anyways, actually, oh! Uh, I wasn't reading the, uh, objectives. I need to get to find the key. So this is something called the Witcher Sense, if you hold the right mouse button. Uh, Nothing but silver. Gold can, clashes with my complexion, you should know that. You can just, you know, like, sense things and it'll highlight stuff for you. Got any clothes that aren't black or white? Mm -hmm. Undergarments. Anyways. So that's Yennefer. The love, just love. I think there's actually... Lilac and gooseberries. Course. There's mo Stop fingering There's multiple people I think you can romance with, but right now I guess you romance with her. I guess in the previous save I romanced with Jennifer. I don't. You're running out of juice. I know. You might bring me some more once you're done training. To be honest, um, so I've pl completed the game by myself before, but I uh, purposely wiped my hard drive when I installed Windows 10. I didn't want to beat the whole game again just to get to New Game Plus. So I used the save that was already completed that I found on the Nexus. Uh, so, and I think they they romance with the Yennefer, but since I New Game Plus it, I don't think any of that saves. So, I don't actually know how to do that. I, know, I think it's a side quest line. Anyways, uh, just got the key. Okay, we can unlock the door here. It was just like right on there. I wonder if it's different in different places if you, other times. Probably not. Probably not meant to be a super RNG heavy puzzle or anything. Old Witcher's fast asleep. Ciri's disappeared somewhere, of course. She prefers practice to theory. Hmm? Why? Time to wake up, Master. These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too? Damn it. After taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls, wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. John of Bruges lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. She's tackling the pendulums, right? How many times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone. It only embeds your errors. Bring our young damsel to the lower courtyard. She wants to practice. She'll get to practice. Don't get mad at her. Why the hell not? The whippersnapper refuses to do as she's told. You like that about her? Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame, but this has to end. Now. Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. Siri must understand that, if she's to become one of us. I'll see you below. There's a lot of cutscenes in this game. I'm sorry if that's what- if you're looking for gameplay right away. Wrong. I'm sorry. Now I see why you were so eager to practice. Strike. You're not in this circus, pirouette. Wrong. Footwork. Enough. Get down. With a flip? What do you think?
Take off the blindfold. Oh, baby, Cinderella looks so cute. You got work to do. Your reflexes are still slow. Maybe for a witcher. Think drowners or striggers will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations? Though in your shoes, I'd fear Vesemir more than any strigger. Disobeying his instructions? Unwise. Well, yes, but that book was horribly dull. I know, and you know that's no excuse. <sighs> I'm sorry. It won't happen again. Better not. Vesemir said if it does, he'll make you eat a bowl of slugs covered in salt. <laughs> you! Exactly. So you'd best behave. Come on, we'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? Not this time. Believe me, you don't want to keep Vesemir waiting. Anything to say for yourself, young lady? Shut up, old man. I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very least, you ought to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the Panthera Tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Mm. So you did read the chapter. Still, you should have asked if... But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. Don't try to weasel your way out of this. A witcher must know how to trick his opponent. You said so yourself. Might have. But don't use my words of wisdom on Vesemir, got it? That's playing with fire. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Ciri with the dummy. Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. What do you think? Should we start by reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Let's skip straight to free training. No point going over the basics again. Well, I think you actually get a... Like a choice the first playthrough, but I think it erases the choice because I'm on New Game Plus. Like to do Whoa, normal training you really showed him, or just kind of start the game. Siri, get down here. <laughs> the little she devil. As soon as she's back, we'll set her to polishing all the swords at Care Moy. Find that helmet? Siri? Uh, I'll make sure to find every last blade for you. Shit. I already know what happens, but you know. Oh shit. That's intense. By the way, I doubt I'll be I'm playing on the hardest difficulty. I doubt I'll be able to finish on this difficulty. Hopefully I don't remember, I think there's an option to change mid uh mid gameplay, so You're all right. 
It's too hard. I'm gonna change <sighs> back. Had a nightmare. About? By the way, if you if you take a closer look in this cutscene, you'll notice explain. one of the mods I have. Try to spot Go it out. Some way off. We've got time. Started in the guest room at Kaer Morin. I was relaxing in a tub, and next to me... Triss? Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Seemed so real in my dream, though. Was she nagging you about something? Hmm. <laughs> mm hmm True to life, indeed. We'll find her. In the dream. I went and found Siri. And then we trained. Those were the days. Hmm. Little she devil. I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Didn't end well, did it? Your dream. No. A wild hunt appeared, attacked Siri. I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. It was just a dream. That's the problem. It was more. In the past, when Siri would appear in my dreams, something was wrong. She was in danger. We taught her how to defend herself from anything, wraiths included. Be dawning soon. Time to go. Wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so... Stop talking for a minute and give me the letter. Hmm. How about that? It does smell of lilac and gooseberries. You were gonna read it, not sniff it. They must meet soon. Will it be near Vizima? Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn? Stuffed unicorn. Used it once or twice. Certain situations. Hmm. The things young folk get up to these days. Back on topic. How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. Wait, hear that? I hear it. I smell it. Ghouls. Okay. Gameplay time. Oh man, it does look like in both on the hardest difficulty and in the game plus mode uh, that these are now level 31 uh, enemies here. I don't know if this game actually has level scaling. Is that and that's why they're this high level, or just the fact that I'm playing the game plus and I'm on the hardest difficulty. As I said, I don't know if I'll actually be able to get through this game on the hardest difficulty. You know, like that might be a hard thing to do. One thing I have to check if that, like, do I already have all my skills, or do I have to drink that thing to unlock them all again? I don't know. Uh, yeah, okay, I, I am just playing the game. Necro pages follow. Okay. Let's go before any more show up. So, as you can see, I have a mod here. This is actually a mod made by CD Projekt Red. It's one of the example mods, because, uh, recently, Ever official mod tools were released. Stop talking about and I also have a mod that makes this first person when I'm riding a horse. From their blood? <laughs> no, because by eating rotting corpses, they prevent epidemics. Hmm. Did he know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him, too. His theory collapsed. Anyway, so yeah, first person horse riding. It's kind of, kind of a mod I have as well. Um, I have a mod called Immersive HUD. It's supposed to disable HUD when not in combat, but it doesn't seem to be working correctly. Well, Maybe the mod's exactly for an older patch. I don't know. We have a side. The Northern Realms. Radovid's realms, don't you mean? Tamaria and Edern are no more. Radovid's pledged to restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. 
believe that. Hmm. Gotta believe something. It's what keeps us going. So yeah, the um, immersive HUD mod may have been broken by, uh, you know, a patch or something. I don't know. And it's just not updated currently. So, I don't know. I'm on like 1.8.3 or something. So, newest version. We going? As of this video. Help me! Help! It's gone. Yeah. Come out. Gods, that was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it, alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... you'd like a reward, I suppose. You don't owe us anything. You were in need. We helped. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. Because do I need money, really? Do I... Back I think I have all my armor, like right? Like I said, leads to the main or road and not. ends I don't know. I, as I said, I have to check you my inventory. seek someone? Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No. But... There's an inn here in White Orchard. Sol one around. Gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there? Besides, the innkeep's my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure, could use a good rye, nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. Okay. Anyways, uh, how do you like my unicorn roach? Uh, oh wait, hold on, actually. Oh, I still can't check my inventory. Oh my god. I don't care. Why are the... Uh... Okay. I can't access my inventory yet, apparently. I should have turned tutorials off. I know how to play the good fucking game. Jeez. Okay. Let's go! So, the griffin this close to the village? Strange. My thoughts exactly. In the forest of the mountains, sure, but here? Near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Perhaps monsters crazy sometimes. Men, too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard. And we should leave as soon as we learn anything. Oh, and uh, one other mod that I have. I think I've showed you all of them so far. One mod that I don't think I've showed you, or obviously I haven't showed you, is I can fast travel from anywhere. So, that's another one. And I can zoom out the map as much as I want. Like when I'm zooming in the map, I can I can zoom out as much, like in, infinitely, I think. Or I, can, or I can go pretty far, you know. So it's a little helpful. What? Take that down before there's trouble. That is your coat of arms, the Tamerian lilies. They've a right to hang there. This ain't Tamaria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse! 
course it is. Witches. I'll not drink with Weaver Law's freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. <laughs> Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? How is he? Alive. Sends his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I get you? Show me what you got behind the counter. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hey. Inventory is unlocked. Cool, so I do, it does look like I have all the armor and, sh and shit. Uh, apparently, though, I don't have a whole lot of food on me for some reason. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, do, or how, much, how much money do I have? It's up here. So I'm just gonna, just gonna buy some food. You know. Just some spice and food, you know? Nothing too big. And I'm sorry I'm not talking too much. I know this is a let's play, but there's a lot of cutscenes, and I feel I shouldn't talk too much during them. Looking for a woman. Raven haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Thanks for everything. I like how when I bought things from her, wherein before she said it's on the house, Master Witch. I still had to pay for things. Could you be of a mind to kill for Griffin? Beasts are scourge on our land. Only killed livestock at first, but it's got a taste for human flesh of late. We'd have feared to set foot outdoors. If someone will pay us, won't say no. Help you bandage that up? Please. I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm-hmm. Just remember, we'd rather not draw any attention. Okay. Finally in gameplay again. Okay. Um... So... Just a little quick save there. I'm looking for someone. And we seek some peace and quiet. Out of my face, freak. For your breath sours my beer. Raven-haired woman dressed in black and white. Seen her? Talk. Folks say the lady rode through the village a few days back. Galloping so fast she knocked Radabor into a ditch. Which way did she go? Dunno. Lots of tracks leading off the main road. Could have gone anywhere. Oi, people! The freak's taken Micah's mind! Uh-huh. And I'll take your tongue if you don't shut up. Damn, son, where'd you find that? Yeah, so I used my power, what is that called again? Axi? I can fuck with people's minds. It's pretty cool. Pretty fucking cool. Wait, you know what? I do want to check something real quick. Yeah, I, I get it. Oh, uh, fuck. Anyways, uh, so I have... I'm pretty sure I have, like, the best stuff on. I don't know if I'm wearing the best stuff in the game. 
or not. But um, what I'm pretty much saying is I could can sell all of this if I get to a person I can sell stuff to because all this stuff is is, is weaker. Um, <clears throat> uh, what was I going in my inventory for? Fuck. I fucking forgot. I guess just to check. I don't even... Okay. I don't even remember what I was going in my inventory for. <laughs> Look, it's baby Cirilla. Uh, something I wish I could have tried there is if I... See, if I could have done the training, that means I would have been able to play during... Uh, dream, uh, Karamoran, and, uh, I wanted to see what happens if I would, uh, if I turned into Cirilla, into Cirilla with the command console, uh, if it would have made me baby Cirilla or not, but I, I guess, uh, I couldn't because I'm playing New Game Plus, because I remember that there being a, I guess I could have done it, you know, before, when I was in, still in my room or whatever, but... You know, similar to clubs and spades, except each. Because uh, if you want to see, see, I have a, I have a thingy, and I can do this. I don't know if it's gonna, you know, I'm gonna save real quick. I honestly don't know what's gonna happen since I've never played a Sorelli yet. Um, it's replace player. Oops. Oh, oh my God. Re replace player. Do that. Siri. Oops, not Soro. Siri. And there you go. It you see. Um, but if you go into a cutscene, either it makes you so your Geralt, or it just glitches the fuck out. So I'm not gonna do that. Uh, we're gonna go back to Geralt. Um, and I'm not gonna use this to cheat. I just wanna kind of. Okay, so when I had uh, turned back into Geralt, uh, either I spelt it wrong somehow, I don't think I did, uh, maybe I was just being stupid and I spelt it wrong, or, um, you know, just, oh, you know what, here's the thing. Okay, so how this mod is supposed to work, the iHUD mod, is it disables all HUD and uh, the mini-map, including the mini-map, um, when not in combat. And then it's supposed to make it so when you right-click, uh, which is, you know, which is, which is, which is, um, oh my god, I, Witcher, Witcher senses, uh, it will go, it will appear and then disappear after a few seconds. Um, but none of the rest of the HUD is disappearing. I know I can turn off this HUD in the settings, but I mean, it, it normally it would it should turn back on and off. As I said, I think the mod just isn't working correctly because uh, it's like outdated or something. Oh, also I forgot, I actually have a mod that makes Geralt look different. I completely forgot that I had that. Um, and you guys may have noticed that. I completely forgot that that was actually a thing that I had. Um, I don't actually notice the difference, probably because it's been a while since I've actually played this game vanilla, uh, because I'm just getting back into this. Um, but yeah, that's different. He looks different than normal. Anyways, uh, apparently the conversation... Russell, maybe, maybe I didn't talk time. to these guys, I thought The Earth shall revolve around the sun before you comprehend these rules. It's Gwent. I've Got never played Gwent. Why not? Aldert Git, assistant professor in contemporary history at Oxenfurt Academy. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher with tenure. I'm looking for a woman, long hair, dressed in black and white. Seen anyone like that? Of course not. Unlike the populace, I know the horsewoman of war is pure poppycock. Okay then. And farewell. Gotta go. So long. A moment, Witch. You strike me as a man of the world. Are you familiar with Gwent? No, and I don't have time to learn. But the rules are quite simple. Come, let's play. Uh, no thank you. I like Hearthstone. 
When I played Gwent once, I had no idea what the fuck was going on. And I, I'm bad at Hearthstone anyways, but uh, Hearthstone is pretty different actually. Anyways, no thanks. No, thanks. Got some other things on my mind. And according Shame. to Gus Sorolla, Gwent is pretty bad to compared to Hearthstone, so I'll take his word for it. Uh, well, I don't I'm know if that was on the patch that he said that, or if that was on the RT podcast, but apparently Gus Sorolla thought that, uh, you know, Hearthstone was far superior to Gwent, so I'm not even going to mess around with it. Anyways, uh... I'm probably gonna uninstall the uh, uh, I have mod like before. everyone, not like everyone, and not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapsies. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Uh, this is a point. Finding her, that'll lift my spirits. You look haggard. It's just a few drops to improve your mood. A little schnapsies never hurt a soul. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Wengerberg. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. Once I hear something, I never forget. Can't help it. Uh... How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballot, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. It's a Geralt of Rivia himself. The Butcher of Blaviken. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask. Is this about love? None of your fucking None of your business. business. Yes. As a vagrant, I deserve no explanation. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An elf guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp, she rode in there. Dark of night, black and white, gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thanks. We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. Okay. Oh yeah, um <laughs> Vizmir just like stays here for a couple of years and drinks. Just just saying. Like he we, we won't talk to him for a while. Done drinking. Mm -hmm. Then fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> then fuck off. Don't want your kind here. She's like, oh shit. Yeah, I'm gonna. Haven't done anything to you, so just calm down. Of course, no. I, uh, you done nothing. Horses work in witchcraft. Get him! Man, I couldn't do it all for you. Yeah, this is fine, though. I'm gonna. Just wreck these kids. Come on. And dead guys. I don't know if I've actually killed these guys or I just knocked them out. Just leveled up to 37. Cool. See, I got the, all these fucking items. Okay. Um. I understand how to level this shit up. Okay, uh, wait, did I just take off an ability? What was in here? Uh, fucking hell. Okay, I'll, uh, hit the axis sign one. I don't know. Let's 
stop. I don't care. Cool, I put it there. Okay, what one did I have on? No. I think it was this. I'll I'll do the fucking what, what what even was this? No, uh, X. Yeah, what does this do? Target is not moved towards Garrow while he is casting. It. Cool. Okay. Whatever. I'll leave everything how it is here for a while. I guess. Oh my God! I know. Why did it take? What did it? Yeah, I know. You know what? Hold on, guys. I want to go check uh, tutorials. No. Options. Gameplay. Fucking off. Thank you. Jesus. I don't. I. I Turn them on just in case, but I don't. I don't fucking need them. Okay, uh, cause fuck it. I know how this game works. I mean, I actually, yeah, I know how this game works. So I was gonna say I don't quite remember how the crafting works, but actually I do. It's really simple. You just you get the things, and then you you, you go to a dude, and you, you you do the things. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. <laughs> Anyways. Ask the Nilf Guardians about. Slower. Oh, guys. Now. Wait. Yep, that's great. Now the uh, mini map is not showing up. So, um, actually, I'm gonna end this episode here and we're gonna go ask the Nilf Guardians next episode. I'm just gonna ins uninstall iHUD because it's not fucking working. Uh, maybe I'll check on it eventually and see if they update it or whatever. Gopher needs to update it. Anyways, um, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. It really helps out. Go subscribe to keep on all our videos. I'm Badger. This is probably a pretty, pretty long video, wasn't it? Anyways, I am out. Peace.